Today, I'm making deep fried zucchini, and here are the ingredients that we need. So we need some breadcrumbs. These are Italian breadcrumbs. I've got half a cup of all-purpose flour. I have some baby zucchini, some water for our batter. I also have one teaspoon of salt, a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, a half a teaspoon of baking powder, and one teaspoon of cayenne pepper. So those are the ingredients, so let's get started. All right, what I'm gonna do first, I'm just gonna add all of our dry ingredients to the flour. There we go. And just mix all that up. The cayenne pepper is going to give a nice kick to this. And so will the black pepper. So there we go. The next thing we want to do is we want to add our cold water. And what I'll do is I'll just measure it right now. I was just going to pour it in by eye, which I usually do when I'm not filming. So let's start off with four. That's going to be thick. I can see that's going to be thick already. There's six. And you can still see that's going to be thick. So there's seven. Let's go with eight. You can see the nice color. And let's go with one more. It's almost nine. What you want is something like, you know, the consistency of pancake batter, something like that. So just make sure you really get it worked up and well incorporated here. Oh, that looks good. And it, I, I'm getting the nice smell of the, the cayenne and the pepper and mm. there we go. So you see the, see how it is here? There we go. So that was nine tablespoons of cold water. If you want to substitute that, you can add beer. You could also use milk as well. I have many recipes where I use milk, but for today I'm using water. You could use carbonated water if you wish to. There we go. All right, so let's get on with prepping our zucchini. So I've got the zucchini here. It all depends on what you want to do. If you want, you can just slice them and you can leave the skin on or you can peel them. I usually leave the skin on, but for today I'll, I'll peel them. Maybe I should zoom in a little bit. How's that? Beautiful. Okay. So what I'll do, so I'm just going to cut off the ends. Alright. And we'll just quickly remove the skin. So I'll continue doing this. I'll just speed up the video. Alright, and then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut them into sticks. So there we go, that's the prepping done. That's it for the prep work for, for these. Now what we're going to do is we are going to bread them. So I'm just going to set up and I'll be back in a second. Alrighty, so what we're going to do just grab our little baby zucchini and just put them right into the batter. And then, come here, right into the breadcrumbs. I usually use tongs to lift these out. 
it just it just works better. Where are we? There we go. Yeah. So there's number one. If I'm doing these outside and I'm having a party, I usually do these on the fly. Um, just you know, doing two or three at a time, maybe throwing them into the fryer if somebody's hanging around waiting. You know, kind of hungry. Um, but for this video, what I'll do is I'll do a you know a bunch of them, and then we'll and then we'll head over to the uh, the fryer. I'm gonna set the fryer up here. And we'll do it like that. So there we go. There's another one. So you get the idea. Just coat them in the batter and pop them into the breadcrumbs. There we go. Use any technique that works for you. And then grab them and put them onto the little thing here. There we go. So now we have our zucchini and they are ready for the fryer. So we're going to give them some loving. I'm going to go set up the fryer, the hot oil, and we'll start frying these up. All right, we're ready to fry. I have my oil at 350 degrees and I'm just going to get my first one in here just to test my oil make sure everything's good all right looks great and so let's load them up and we're just we just want to fry them until they're golden brown and there we go So I'll continue frying these, and when they're ready, I'll bring them out. I just have some brown paper from a brown paper bag from the grocery store here. These are getting really, really nice. If you've never made deep fried zucchini, you need to try it out. It's really, really good. I'd say these are done, so I'm just going to bring them out now. Oh, these look good. Don't worry, I will zoom in. Oh, these look amazing. There we go. Beautiful. Deep fried zucchini. So I'll just change up my camera angle so we can see the final product. I'll just zoom in a little bit so we can see our final product. Deep fried zucchini. So here we go. My deep fried zucchini. Oh boy, those look good. Let's zoom in a little bit here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, these are nice. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate that. So that's it for this video. I'll see you next time. Oh, that is good. Yum.